Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mixstar, and this is my list of 10 of English dub characters. Well, I've heard a lot of people when they talk about voice, voice actors and characters, they always reference the, the Japanese one, which is understandable because it is what the characters were based from. And I'm starting all my words right here. But as I got to thinking, yeah, the English voice, the English voice actors do need some gratification too. Yes, I don't know the name. Yeah, I don't know who did it, but I've seen shows of the characters, and that's what I'm going to be talking about. So, yeah. First one is. Well, it's two characters, because you can't have one without the other. So my first one is beautiful Ultramaiden Valkyrie. The two Valkyries, little and big one. Because seriously, you got to appreciate the, but the role that both of them had. Yes, a kind of noble princess. Having to do everything that's been told, be uh, respectful, honest, and all that stuff. Be well mannered and all that. And then you've got little Val, who's uh, basically just a child. <laughs> Which, also another thing I like, well, because she acts like a child, she is. And also, what I'm saying is that both of them have different voices. Because I'm pretty sure that there's two others that you, you see in adult form and in little kid form, they have the same voice. At least with those two, they did, did it good by giving them two completely different voices. Well, basically because she changes personality when she changes. But, yeah. That's my first two. So my next one is Yeah, Shobu Karafuda. <laughs> yeah, Doom Masters. A great game when it when it was out. Still wish it was out over here in England. In the UK. But eh. We can't all get what we want. But Yeah, what I liked that list, yeah, his voice suited him perfectly. And also, yes, even when there are bits when Shobu's voice didn't suit an actual situation, like him um, singing, for say. The only thing, what I liked about that is, yeah, they didn't try and get a person who's good with the voice. Also, criticised the own, his own voice for singing that way, that he hadn't got good pipes. <laughs> but yeah, that is what I loved. <laughs> It when it happens, but yeah, his voice in it suited perfectly. He them criticizing the own his own voice for not being good at situations or perfect, and all the loud and exciting moments and all that, which is very spot on, I would say. So yeah, moving on to the next one. It's Senku. Because, yeah, that's the stone, Senku. You cannot say that the person they got to voice him doesn't have a voice that you would listen to if they were speaking to you for, and talking about science. Because if they got the wrong person, yeah, you wouldn't be that interested, per se. Probably. But because of the voice that they've got for him, which <laughs> everyone does listen. Everyone does listen, and also it's got the comical, well, it can be comical and witty banter and all that stuff with that voice. Which I just loved all the roles that was being played. Yeah, I'm not talking much, but it's a little brief on him. 
Next one. Okay, this is a uh, yeah, Bay from Pokemon from when she first came into it. Yeah, just because she had a voice change, different voice actor, I think, because her voice was completely different when they changed. What she had to begin with suited her. What they changed it to didn't, in my opinion. Because it sounded more like she was going from a kid to being a woman while having a voice of a woman in, what, a few weeks? As basically it would go in between. But yeah, all the exciting, scared bits and enthusiastic, all of them were done perfectly with the voice that she originally had. And there was other times too, which back. I said I can remember them slightly, but it's been ages since I've watched the when Ash was in Hoenn. But yeah, I can I do remember for certain that the voice that she had to begin with suited, the voice that they changed didn't. This is why I've I've said before in other videos that when a voice actor changes, but I don't know for what reason, but you can get draw, drawn out of it. So, yeah. Next one. Oster. Yeah, Black, Black Clover. Seriously. That was a great cast for that voice. Seriously. High, energetic, enthusiastic, determined, and all that stuff. Oh, I can't get any better. Uh, well, if you can... I can't remember the main character's name, but... I, I don't know it. I don't know if... Uh, with another character that had the same voice. Well, enthusiastic and all that. From a uh, Blue Dragon, I don't know if that voice would have worked, but... I say this voice was spot on for us though. So yeah. Kudos. <laughs> okay. Next one. I'm not talking much. Holo. Bison Wolf. I just love the fact that the voice that they picked for her was someone that had like a a no noblest voice. I, I, I don't know how to actually say it. Kind of like what you would hear from a, a noble person if you're talking noble people and poor people. What kind of voice that they would have for a woman. I just love that it was that kind of voice that they made, that they picked for her. Which I think suits her perfectly. And also that voice actor was able to play all her emotions fine. Which suited. So yeah. Moving on. Oh yeah, the next fr I have three more, which yeah it makes it ten. And these are technically all the same show, but also in different shows as also in their own shows as well. So first one, Accelerator. Yes, uh, should I should I say the shows that he's in? Uh, certain science. Scientific acceleration. I think that's what it says. Railgun and index. Magical index. Yeah, these three are going to be from them um, three anime. So I'm just saying it now, so I don't have to say it again. But yeah, accelerator. His voice. I'd say they picked a great one because the voice that he has when he interacts with. Little Misaka there. <laughs> Always perfect. His intimidating voice when he's basically lecturing people. The way he always says that I'm a villain. Which, yeah, you can't get any better than that. Always says it. And all the times he basically demands respect and all the stuff he has to do. 
and basically he's kind of on one leg you know, the whole time. Which, they've got to give him props for that. Yeah, I'm also talking about me itself, but it all goes in hand in hand. What happens in the anime for the voice actor to play in that role. All works. Okay, next one. Tommy Joe. I can't remember his first name. Uh, but I do remember his, his surname, Kamajo. The voice actor they got for him. It's kind of like a a voice of I don't know why I'm here, but I'm here anyway kind of voice, which I think suits him because the only ability that he's got is basically nullify everything with his right hand. Guys, it's not in his left hand too, but eh. I will touch you with my right hand. There, you got no powers. <laughs> all his interactions with all the characters. All the times he has to explain when he's touching someone, how you can't use your powers and all that. Perfect. And all that. High bits, his low bits, everything. I appreciate it. And last one, yeah, you probably kind of guessed it right. Misaki. Uh, Miska, yeah. I did I say the, I say Misaki. Miska. Yeah. Her voice. Seriously, it's kind, I don't know, it's sort of, I don't know, kind of, I think, on the verge of being whiny-ish. I'm not sure, I think. I know I've recently seen seen stuff from it, and but I can't quite picture where where it's going to be in the voice spectrum. But yeah, everything that she does, I'd say perfect. All the times when she's using the powers and all that, all her interactions with Roko, <laughs> friends and all that. Everything she has to deal with. All the time she's embarrassed when people point out the fact that you are in love with Kama Jo, just will not admit it. Or you will admit it to yourself, but you just won't admit it out loud. All those shy bits. Perfect. So yeah, I know it's kind of a weird one, which I don't know if I actually did any good or what but I hope everyone all enjoyed it so yeah I, d I don't know if it's going to be like a habit to do stuff like this well uh, I'll probably have to do another list of 10 but it's going to be in other categories as well because one might be games there might be anime itself and other stuff, I, I don't know, it's, you could suggest a category that I work, I work from, eh, see how that goes, could be fun, an interaction, I wouldn't mind, but yeah, so after all this, that's my 10, I could do another one, so we'll, this is just one, but yeah, so, I'm going to end this here, hope you liked it, hit the like button, subscribe, bell for notifications, comment, and I'll see you next time. Bye.